This is your boy, RJ Uploads, coming at you guys with another video. This one is uh, going to be a haul of cases for the Pixel 9, also known as the 9 Pro, with that extra camera and a few other upgrades. But that's neither here nor there. We're talking about cases right now and a few other accessories as well. So I'm going to get right to it. I'm not going to talk that much. I was going to do a quick video, but I'm going to have to make it quicker because my daughter's I want me to play. One just brought me this. <laughs> she told me to hurry up and finish this video. So I'm finna roll. Let's see here. All right. Here's my Pixel 9 Pro, by the way, y'all. Um, this skin came from Soapy Guards, by the way. For those that just want to know, this um, camera, lens, protector, whatever you want to call it, that is also metal. By the way, this came from Timu, which I will tell y'all guys, if y'all don't want to spend an arm and a leg on some cases, I will tell y'all to go ahead and look there. It won't take long to get them. And they are very cheap and very decent cases. I got a few of them scattered off in here right now. We're going to get to it as we go. I'm just going to go through the haul. Y'all probably already seen a, a couple of cases already, but here we go. By the way, looks good, by the way. I like it. I like it. Uh, first case, let's see which one do I want to go to first. I right, the one of the most recent ones I got, which is all right, it didn't cost much, but uh, it's a spec case. You can pick these up in the U.S. basically anywhere or at your best buys or whatever. I just jumped on one because I wanted an all black case to see how it would look and feel and not necessarily a flat sided case. One thing I will say about this case is um, got a pretty good material to it, TP. Um, uh, carbonate, whatever you want to call the doggone. It's very flexible all the way around, as you can plainly see. I will say this thing if you got oily ass hands like me, this joker is going to be a fingerprint smudgy magnet. But <laughs> here we go. Pop it on, as you can plainly see. Nice fit. Pop that on there, by the way. Catches the edges very nicely. If I do say so myself, the corners on it are, hmm, I ain't going to say flat, but they ain't all the way around, but they got a little slight round to it, the buttons on it. My mic may be um, doing that active noise counseling, so you might not hear it, but the buttons are very clicky on it. Yeah, got nice resivity on around the borders, across the top. The cutouts are basically on point, perfect. All the way around. You got some nice resivity above the cameras, even with that uh, lens protector on it. It's still slightly above it. So there you go. All right. Yeah. And you can lay it face down, no problems at all. So that's this case. As you can plainly see, the edges are pretty tight. Ain't going to be no major coming off of there. Not like my, uh, what's that case I returned? Oh, yeah, Bell Roy. Yeah, no, see, that's what I'm talking about. If I want a case, I need that joker to be snug. So, yeah, this is your spec design. Also, as you can plainly see, the inside has the ribs for the protection for the drop. If you can see that good enough, all the way around inside, that's your air pockets. All right, spec out the way. Nice case, not my favorite case. All right, on to the next. Which other one I want to look at? All right, I'm going to get these bad boys around that you can pick up in the U.S. first. Here, out of box. By the way, that is a ESR Universal Ring for that mag safe action when y'all want it. Pretty simple. Drop it on. Look good. Case is transparent or see-through on the back with the transparent size or the frosted size, however you want to call it, all the way around. Pretty nice case. Nice cut out across the top for your speaker area. Goes all the way around. You got your. Man, let me just put this damn thing in there. Here we go. There. There you go. Fits nicely. Sits in. Camera area. Still above. Even with my lens protector on, it still sits high enough. It's a nice case. I just don't like the way they did the inside, even though it fits all the way up around. 
it, it looks like it's got space in it, but it doesn't. It actually has a, a layer of the case actually goes on up to the frame of the camera, which is nice. But I look like this, like more uh, uh, trap dust area, if you ask me. But I still like it. Uh, the resivity on it is there. But the way they got theirs is it's got like a, as you can plainly see, it's kind of beveled off to make you feel like you really basically strolling straight on the phone with no problems at all. Which I actually like the way they did that, to be honest. Cutouts and everything are all perfect, even with the skin on the back. Everything else lines up pretty good. Buttons, they work. They're not as clicky as the other ones, but they work just fine, to be honest. It's just the way they got it set up. So, yeah. But this case, I'm going to show you why. Even though this case, it ain't that much. I think you can find this case online for like 25, 26 bucks. But Autobots got some thing that they deal with. With this. It literally comes in no uh, packaging for the most part. Just a small little packaging. You can get this one for around 25, 26 bucks, I think. If I'm not mistaken. But yeah, I'm going to sit there. While I'm showing you this Autobots one, let me show you the ones that I got from Timu. <laughs> All right, Timu. Y'all go get the haul from Timu, man. I'm just gonna go ahead and tell you right now. This is one I actually like. I seen a company recently just came out that had a transparent case for the Pixel 9 that are charging. And I know it ain't about the money, but it's about the money. They are charging 44 to 50 bucks for a transparent case by the stand is this one. Timu got this case on their website. For if I'm not mistaken, around <laughs> three or four bucks. <laughs> Transparent see-through. And it feels great. Slim, as you can plainly see, covers the phone. Transparent. I can still see my skin. Got your buttons, your cutouts, everything. Still feels good. Not necessarily mushy, but not necessarily clicky. So there you go. That goes all the way around. Covers your case nicely. Fits well all around the sides. All the cutouts are there. It's got your, I guess, your millimeter wave antenna sitting there chilling. Dude, I like this case. And for the price, you can't beat it, y'all. This is the one off Timu. I have to leave some links in the description. I don't know how to just share those yet, but I attach them as I go once I upload this video. That's one clear case. Here's the other one that I got to go heads up against the outer box one because of the gray sides as well, which is another Timu case. <laughs> this case is very sturdy all the way around. Got your nice little old slim cutout across the top. You got your air pockets in here as well. You can't really see it all that well until you look from the outside on all corners. Yeah. This is the one. Also, I think around four or five bucks. Twenty some bucks. Four bucks. Plus, this one's majorly for the nine pro. You can also get it for the nine, the pro XL. I think even going down to the eights and all that does. But yeah, it lines up with the case. Start with that side. And there it is. Now, what I like about it is the metal trim that they got around here, right around the camera area, and also the metal buttons. That you got right here. They are clicky. So if you like that, shows all of your cutouts that's in the camera as well, with no problems at all. Go around. You got very good resivity on it. You ain't got to worry about that going at your corner, getting caught up on anything. Also, once again, this is a mag glass matte screen protector on here. I honestly am waiting on the Prism 2.0. Whenever they get here, I'm going to put it on to see how it works. And that might be the case uh, screen protector that I stick with. And that's the one from D-Brand. But it hadn't showed up yet. Lord, it's been almost a month. <laughs> that's not it. No, that's another rant for another day. But when I get here, I won't rant about it. This case is tough. Won't come off. All right. There we go. All right. That's another clear case. I'm getting the clear cases out the way for the most part. All right. Here's another one. And this case right here reminded me of the other case. I actually had the out of box symmetry case. I took it back. I didn't like it. To me, it felt it was like too thick of a uh, clear. 
It just won for me. I, it might be for other folks, but it won for me. I think the back side of it was way too thick, and I preferred. I think they not this one. Listen to me. Look at me. I preferred the React case or whatever name of this case is. I can't ever remember the name, but I've seen like two different names for this case online for the out of box. That's neither here nor there. But here you go with the other Timu case. All clear. Gotcha. Hard PC back, which is clear across the top and bottom. You got your nice camera area. It's not giving away like this one as well. You see how that edge is comes in. I think they just made this too wide. They just narrowed this thing down in just this much. This thing would have been awesome. They did it right with this one, if you ask me. It's all the way around. Looks good. Clear. You got your resivity on here. Your cutouts and everything are great. Buttons on here. I don't know if this metal or plastic. Either way, though, they're clicking. They are very clicky. Some of the clickiest buttons I got right now, but then they stick out very much. <laughs> As y'all can play, let's see. I have to show that to you. I don't know what I'm about no yellowing or how long will it stay like this. Really don't know. I got clear cases that hadn't yellowed on me in a while, so I haven't had them for a while. I have a ton of cases, y'all, by the way. All right, take this one off. All right, get these out the way for now. Pause. By the way, when I was talking about the camera lens, this also came from Timu. I think this thing was like $2 and some change. Y'all hear me when I'm talking about it. Look, $2 and some change. And this is a metal lens protector, by the way. Looks good. Sits there. No hindrance at all. And I love it. All about that protection. All right. Now. Y'all have already seen this case on one of my other videos. I talked about how much I love this case, which transparent. It's got the metal ring inside to make the case actually look good. I put it on just to show it to y'all again, just show you what I'm talking about. It's got a transparent hull. Gives you that fine look. Get this bigger thing out the way. You already got your MagSafe ring built in. You got your flat sides with your either metal or plastic buttons. Don't know. Don't let me lie to you. I know it's, this one is on Amazon. Hold your horses, little girl. I got you. One second. All right, y'all. Excuse me for that. I tried to keep the pose, but I had to pause the video for a second. My littlest one came in, and, and here she comes again. Well, I'm not going to stop this time. All right, going back in there. I'm talking about something. <laughs> back to the video. This, it, look at me. Oh, God. <laughs> they they threw me out. Anyway, check out the screen. I guess the protector, how it looks. Screen protector for the lens. How it looks with this case makes it look doggone it bad ass, if you ask me. With this transparent back, the MagSafe ring. And I like the way they got it where it's smooth. It, it flows up to the camera. It's not just a hard go in and stop and go up, if you ask me. That's why I love this case. This is one of my favorite cases. I, I will always, probably more than likely, be rocking this case. It's going to be in the rotation probably the most out of all of them because it still gives me that transparent look, the flat sides, the nice edges in the front, the raised bezel around the area where you just do. You got to love it. You got to love it. All right. Let me take this one off. But that's why this is one of my favorites. This one's on Amazon. I'm going to have to leave the links in the description for all these if I can. All right. Here's this other case. Timu Hall, ladies and gentlemen. Look at that. Timu Hall. I'm going to say it again. Timu got some great cases. Look, look, look these edge, the corners, the sides, they are so stiff. It's not even loose down here at the bottom like a lot of my phone cases are, where it's just right around that area. It's, it's just soft around the buttons, around the port area. Not this one. Not this one. You got the metal ring. You got your MagSafe section. You got your kickstand. And it closes just like that. You got your, for gripping, here, this is what you got. All the way around, just like that. All right, let's put this bad boy on and see what we're working with. And there you go. Also, sits very nicely with the camera lens on the inside. No problems at all. Leave it with the skin on the inside. Phone sits and works just fine. 
You got your cutouts and everything. Looks great. Buttons. Very clicky. Up and down. Volume. You got your grip size. Dude, this phone case feels nice. And the fact that this, I guess the form factor is what got me all the way. It's not a big phone, but it's okay size, if you ask me. So that's that. Also, the transparent back on it as well. Drop your kickstand. Yeah. You want it up. You set it right there. You like it like that. Set it like that, I guess. Let me see. Let me see if I can set that. Nice. There. But that's not a hill over there. Got a kickstand. I don't know. MagSafe ring will work even better. But I didn't get it for that. I actually got it for the color. And I also got a black one ordered and another. Because this thing is like two bucks on Timu. <laughs> so we're going to go from there. All right. Also, if you didn't check that out, the raised corners for better protection. If you decide to drop your phone, throw your phone at somebody, hit them with it, that grip, a little extra grip, probably do a little bit more damage. <laughs> wait, wait, before I go hard, before I go hard, this thing right here, this ring. Motherfucker, I got to show. I love this thing uag magnetic ring anywhere anywhere this thing just damn, thank you boy it is tough i love this thing this is when you want a stand anywhere spinning around turn it like that you just want a new tv style setup just sit at your desk or whatever you want to do Bam, you got it right there. Let me get out of that screen. You got that set up. You spin it down. You don't want it that way. You just got it that way. I mean, dude, I got to show it to you. You don't like it like that. It just looks that way. You don't like it like that. Bend it back. You don't like it like that. Spin it around like I just see it. You can turn it over. Set it up how you need to while you're at your desk, eating, catching fades or suede or however you want to do so you can at least get a little glimpse you don't like it like that hey guess what ring style set it up like that can't beat it just want to hold it you know what i want to hold my phone today i just sit there and rock it like that i don't necessarily want to do it. i don't know why <laughs> i'm sorry y'all i'm just rambling but look, I'm just trying to show you all the thing, dude. I love this thing. The only thing it don't do is like what well, I've seen a few phones got with that magnetic setup where it just slaps on everything. But after that, dude, this thing here is awesome. Ah, that ring. Oh, so satisfying. All right, I got two more cases to go. And I'll be done after that. Uh, y'all know me. I'm a fan. Look, I done turned the flashlight on and all that shit. All right, back down. Two, let's see what we got left. This case. Pretty badass case, if you ask me. You can find this one on Amazon. It's got the metal ring around it. Got your inside, I guess, grooves to help for if you drop your phone. Right there, you got your grooves as well. Got your metal buttons. Drop it in. And voila. Got your ring for the back. Also. Got your sides. This is not necessarily, by the way, um, carbon fiber or airmen fiber. It is more of a print with a, this thing has a soft feel to it. It's like padded with a metal ring around here as well. I love this thought process when they did this. Whoever thought of it first, kudos, because you rubbed off on everybody. I love this. The metal buttons work just fine. You got nice. Bezels, let's mean bezels. Raised bezels around here so to protect the front screen, even with the double screen protector on here. Yeah, I have to show it to y'all. Get up a little close. Everything looks good on here. Everything. So let me take that one off. I don't know if I showed this one off as much as I should have with this one, but this phone, I'm gonna go back to it if I did. 
Let me say another reason why I like this. That grill down there for the speaker. I don't think I pointed that out enough. I love that when I find these on certain phones. The last time I seen that, it was on my uh, OG Pixel Fold, a case that I got off Amazon. But this is the other Timu Hall. I love this. Once again, y'all get y'all butts on Timu. Y'all may not want to, but hey, here's what it is. You get your stuff and you get your stuff pretty quick. This case right here. I thought this was going to be a quick video. I'm in 20 minutes in. <laughs> That's not the end of that. Look, I ended up getting this Aramid Fiber case off of um, Amazon. I think this thing is going for 20, 28, 29 bucks. But it's completely Aramid Fiber, 600D. And what I like about this one, Unlike the, hate to say it, the, the later case or the thin born or whoever else, this one don't have, the. it actually has the cutouts around the button and you still get your protection on up to the frame instead of all this being gone or the bottom being gone or the, even the top. Sometimes I've seen on some of these more expensive aramid fibers. You can get this. For 20 something bucks, right at 30 bucks, somewhere in that range. And you still get your cutouts that are dead on point. Even the bottom. Nothing is gone. My phone still feels like a phone without doggone it. Just random stuff for me feeling sharp edges for the most part. It still has semi, I think it's right at my screen protector when I say it. But as far as the cutout goes, Everything is on point. No problems there. It's not bothering my uh, lens at all for my screen protector. I mean, this is my lens for my screen. Lens for my cameras, my camera screen. Y'all know what the hell I mean. <laughs> I'm too deep in this now <laughs> to be doing anything. But yeah, I love this case. If y'all want to find one, I mean, look, I'm not, not knocking everybody else. But in a sense, I don't think y'all should be charging it. We how much? I think I've seen some of them cases. Sixty-six dollars, fifty dollars, eighty bucks, ninety dollars for a thin case. As far as these go, so I uh, think this case did it right. Like I said, nothing's missing, nothing's gone. You get everything, and you still got your form factor for your phone. Plus, I get to put my UAG on. My universal ring, if you want MagSafe. And yeah, oh, by the way, for those that want to know, with all this on, and I didn't try it on all of them, but yeah, look, look, they work. I'm just going to put it down. And it still works, as you can plainly see. It still freaking works. So, yeah. All right. Google Pixel 9 or 9 Pro. Cases, Hall, Timu, Amazon. Look, shop around. I'm pretty sure y'all get a decent whatever y'all need because it's out there. Just don't go to one place and give them everything. But as far as my top cases, I think this one's number one. Uh, this is a split between number two or the next runners up that I'm gonna probably be using. This is going to be my number three, but I am going to put a MagSafe ring on this one. This one may be number four. And it's going to be a toss-up. You might be the guy retired now since this one didn't show up. We will see, though. And this one. I don't know. We will find out. These are going to be hanging out in the background. Nobody knows for now. <laughs> I had a few other ones somewhere else, but I don't know what it is. This is your boy, RJ Uploads. With this haul of Pixel 9 slash 9 Pro cases. And I'm out, man. I hope y'all enjoyed it. Peace.